This is the unearthed competition field. There are 15 missions, which can be done in any order. You do not have to complete all the missions. Just try as many as you can in each two and a half minute match. Only the score from your best match will be counted. Your robot must start completely inside one of the launch areas, and you should program it to return to either home area. You can handle and modify your robot between runs while it is completely inside either home area. Make sure to read the Robot Game Rulebook to understand how points are scored for each mission and to understand the rules that apply before, during, and after a match. Teams should demonstrate core values at the Robot Game and will receive a gracious professionalism score at each official match. Teams will start every match with an accomplished score, but developing and exceed scores are also possible depending on the core values a team demonstrates. Equipment Inspection Before the match begins, you will need to pass the pre-match inspection and set all your equipment in place. Your robot and all your equipment must fit in both launch areas and under a height limit of 12 inches. If all your equipment can fit in just one launch area and under this height limit, your team will score points. Mission 1. Surface Brushing You'll need special tools to clean and uncover buried artifacts without damaging them. Brush away sediment to uncover a piece of this civilization's past. If soil deposits are completely cleared touching the mat, if the archaeologist's brush is not touching the dig site. Mission 2. Map Reveal Archaeologists work to unearth important clues about how a civilization lived. Shift and remove topsoil to reveal sections of a hidden map. If topsoil sections are completely cleared, Mission 3, Mineshaft Explorer. Ayana the archaeologist is on a mission to discover every secret of the dig site and share what she finds with her team. If your team's minecart is on the opposing team's field, bonus, and if the opposing team's minecart is on your team's field. Mission 4, Careful Recovery. When parts of a site are too dangerous for humans, Technology can be used to safely recover artifacts. If the precious artifact is not touching the mine, if both mine support structures are standing. Mission five, who lived here? Rebuild the structure to restore a vital part of the village where people once lived. If the structure floor is completely upright, mission six, Forge. Ayana's team believes this forge was used to smelt ore and craft tools. Release the ore blocks and search carefully. One block holds a mysterious artifact waiting to be discovered. If ore blocks are not touching the forge, Mission 7. Heavy Lifting. This millstone enabled people to process grain and gives insight into their daily lives. Due to its size, moving this artifact could prove to be a challenge. If the millstone is not touching its base. Mission eight, silo. Empty the silo of the preserved food so it can be analyzed at the lab. If preserved pieces are outside the silo. Mission nine. What's on sale? Restore the market stall and reveal items that were once traded between the village and its visitors. If the roof is completely raised. If the market wares are raised. Mission 10. Tip the scales. This ancient tool ensured that each item received a fair and balanced price. If the scale is tipped and touching the mat, if the scale pan is completely removed. Mission 11, Angler Artifacts. Your team has discovered some interesting artifacts at the port. Use the crane to excavate the site. If artifacts are raised above the dig site, bonus. 
and if the crane flag is at least partly lowered. Mission 12, Salvage Operation. An ancient ship discovered at the beach is at risk of further decay. Excavate the vessel without damaging its delicate structure. If the sand is completely cleared, if the ship is completely raised. Mission 13, Statue Rebuild. Reconstruct the statue to help piece together its historic significance. If the statue is completely raised. Mission 14, Forum. Deliver artifacts to the forum. Consider what the artifacts tell you and what mysteries remain. If an artifact is touching the mat and is at least partly in the forum. Mission 15, Site Marking. There's so much yet to be discovered at this dig site. Place flags to mark locations for further study. If sites have a flag at least partly inside and touching the mat, Precision Tokens. If you interrupt your robot outside home, you will lose a precision token. Precision tokens left on the field will result in extra points. The less you interrupt your robot outside home, the more points you will keep. Remember to read the Robot Game Rulebook and to check for challenge updates during the season. Good luck with the Unearthed Robot Game.